what is going through the minds in Boston right now? I know Houston just wrapped up the AL West. They have a uh, hundred win seasons back to back for the first time in their franchise's history. But what's going through the minds of a Red Sox team that has absolutely surprised by how how successful they have been all year long? And it looks like they, then they're going to have to play a five game series against either the A's or their their hated rivals from New York City, Jason. Well, the whole AL half of the draw is going to be epic. Epic. You'll have 300-win teams and, you know, potentially, or if the Yankees don't get any, you'll have a team with the best record in baseball since the middle of June. Uh, and the, the Red Sox are the best team. They've earned that. Um, you, you, you've been in New England once or twice. You, you, <laughs> they're surrounded by people who have figured out everything that could possibly go wrong. Chris Sale isn't ready. He loses game one. And they've got to turn to David Price, who's never won a postseason start. If Chris Sale loses game one, it's panic in the streets throughout New England. I don't think there's any doubt about that. But they're the best team. Are they the favorite? I don't know. But they're the best team. And when it comes down to it, um, they, they J.D. Martinez and the, and the crucible of the playoffs in Boston, we will see how that all goes down and and obviously Houston's been there and done that. Do you believe Boston is the best team though? You you called epic. Are they are well, they when you if you had to put your marker on somebody, who do you put it on, Jason Stark? I I, I think that the most complete team, if healthy, would be the Astros. Um and yet I've had people tell me that the winner of Astros Indians, the series I'll be covering, is going to go win the World Series because the Indians are incredibly dangerous. I mean, they're top three offense in the game with a, with a great rotation. And, you know, there's questions about whether their bullpen has got itself straightened out. But, you know, October affords a lot more rest than the regular season, and that plays into their hands. They've got a great manager. Um, it's I, I don't know anybody who's got a good feel for who's going to win, especially over in the American League. The Rich Eisen Show, weekdays at noon Eastern on Audience.